All right, coming up next, a welterweight matchup between Jorge Masvidal and Conor McGregor. So here he is, the biggest superstar in mixed martial arts history, the former two-division UFC champion, Conor McGregor, back in a mixed martial arts setting for the first time in a long time. Of course, many of you ingested his boxing match with Floyd Mayweather. Thankfully, all of that is in the past, and Conor McGregor's present is a return to the greatest proving ground in MMA here tonight. Conor McGregor has that it factor, along with a fantastic and creative striking game, a very good ground game, and extreme confidence in himself. All these make for a fan-favorite combination. So here is a pro dating to 2003. Here is the consummate veteran, Jorge Gamebred Masvidal, arguably the greatest mixed martial arts athlete the state of Florida has ever produced. Longtime staple of the American top team in Coconut Creek, Florida. He's got heart, the toughness to go with it, cardio, an outstanding jab, and it's a submission game to go with it. This is one of the more well-rounded welterweights in the world, and as such, he has vaulted into title contention. This guy has insanely fast kicking technique. If you are within kicking range, you are in a world of trouble. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Masvidal is four years his senior. He is two inches taller. The reach is identical. All right, here now, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC welterweight division. Introduce your first. Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer. Holding a professional record of 21 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Dublin And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 32 wins, 13 losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Jorge Gabriel. All right, get the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners. I am fight. very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is going to go right, down right now. Let's go all right, fight. the wait is over. We are underway here at the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. All right, ready to go round one, and as usual, so is Jorge. Game bred Masvidal. This is a man who has seen it all. Totally unfazed by anything that could be coming his way. The majority of his UFC fights have gone the distance, but we have seen an uptick in aggression lately as he's moved into welterweight contention. Another big one for Game bred tonight. Effective strike there by Connor. 
Joe, your thoughts on what we'll see in this matchup tonight? One thing to look out for in this fight are the counter shots of Conor McGregor. Oh, nice. Didn't quite connect. Oh, a huge block there. Ty clinch here, Joe. Over, under now in the clinch. Good body shot. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Oh, McGregor's pummeling, works in that underhook. Masvidal gets caught with that punch. Hit him hard with that shot is true. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Nice jab. Really missed with that right hand. Trademark inside leg kick there by Connor. Missed with that right hand. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it. So let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. Oh, beautiful left hook. Lanza glancing right hand upstairs. Oh, and another punch by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. And there he swung with the haymaker. Finds his range with the jab. Huge punches landed by both bends. Missed that shot. Oh, how clean is that jab by Gamebred? Gamebred gets caught by the inside line. And he tags it with the straight, beautiful place there. Ah! He's rocked. Attempts a big hook to the head, but misses. Oh, McGregor's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. got over on He transitions to the tie clinch. So battling for position here on the clinch once again, Joe. Both fighters trying to gain a more advantageous position. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Missed the mark. Nice. Good kick. From McGregor. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Well, he's always on the counter attack, but a nice leg kick there by McGregor. And he's looking for that left. Oh, that's a good jab right there. Game Bread gets caught with that punch. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Round two is next. Stop, stop. And there's the horn. Huge knockdown in that round. Great round from McGregor. Yeah, that knockdown should have won him the round. It was a big moment in the fight. Let's look at that again. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Sit down, relax, breathe, okay? You gotta 
suck it up this round. You're not tired. I want you to go out there and I want you to get this takedown. Brittany Palmer with us. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Second round underway. Back to the straight punch here, Joe. It's good. Sound defense there as he blocks the shot. Oh, he found the target there, Joe. Nice punch. Effective punch there by Gainbrick. Well, Joe, he seems to have his opponent's timing down. He has landed some good shots, but nothing really in terms of multi-shot combinations, and perhaps that's why his opponent's still standing. So perhaps at this point, he could change up the power with which he throws some of these strikes, maybe alter the tempo a little bit, and try to make it so it's not just... Oh! He's got him hurt here. And now a head kick to boot. He hurt him with that hook. Oh, very nice. Well, yet again, he goes back to the jab and he lands it. And defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. He continues to lean into his opponent's striking range. He's going to have to stick and move and figure out a way to get his head off the center line. Good body shot. Back and forth we go. Nice body kick there. He's in big trouble. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. How about that shin? McGregor's facial cut is getting worse now, Joe. Man, is that thing fauceting blood. Big looping right hand there. Oh, he missed that kick. McGregor gets tagged yet again. It's hard to remember a fight in which he has been hit this often. And a left hand behind it. Effective punch there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on... Big oh. left hand! Man, has his chin been tested early. This is crazy! Oh, my goodness! Oh, big left hook there! Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Big straight punch! He's doing a great job of timing these shots. Blocks the shot. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. It's one two punch by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Less than two minutes now to go in round two. You got to be careful when you throw the same technique over and over and over again. Slips the punch nicely wow. there. Oh! This could be it right here. And another one. He's in trouble. Big body, body shot. shot there, too. Very nice. Woo! Woo! Look at that jab. Oh, he's tagging him. Excellent movement on the ground here. Always trying to better his position. Yeah, this ain't good for Masvidal. Punch there by McGregor. He hip escapes from the full mount. Posture's up here and now going to the body with that big strike. Nicely done by McGregor. And he reverses position. Back up. That shot blocked by Connor. Oh, when you see a cut this nasty, sometimes the doctor comes in and this fight gets stopped. We might not be far from that, Joe. Not much behind the takedown offering there. Well, he is eternally aggressive, but he 
paid for it there. His head was wide open, and his opponent is able to land the uppercut there. He's going to have to figure some things out here, Joe. Manage his wrist better. I know he's confident in his chin, but right now he's becoming a sitting duck. Battle for position here. Double underhooks in the clinch here, Joe. Huge uppercut misses. That's Saved by the bell. That's the end of the round, and thankfully for him, it came at the right time. He got knocked down just before the horn. We'll see if his corner can keep him in the fight. Just 60 seconds with which to recover here before the next round. Here's a powerful punch that results in a knockdown. Let's see it one more time. Ariane Celeste on hand. He is not slowing down whatsoever. Hard kick to the head. Tagged him. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by McGregor. Good knee to the body by Connor. How about that chin? Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. No! Oh, he tagged him! Wow! wow. Back to his feet again, amazing. Big body shot, body! Oh, McGregor's hook to the body there is blocked. Shot looked pretty good, but ultimately the defense was there. Oh, he's hurt again! He is in trouble! to over under control. And he connects there. That cut on his nose is pouring blood. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. He pummels out of double underhooks. Body shot. Switching stances here. Oh! He's in a lot of trouble. Stretch. He is really lighting him up now. Punch coming, it's blocked. We passed the midpoint here in the front. Leg kick. Oh! He's out! That was excellent timing here to land a big left hand to stop the fight. Yeah, Joe, just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Let's take one more look at this overhand. Right on the money, and the fight is over as soon as it lands. Check out this angle here. Boom! And that's all she wrote. Well, what a moment for him here tonight. A huge knockout on one of the sport's biggest stages. 
That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Here once more, Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliotta has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 33 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by So, and still your UFC lightweight champion, the notorious Conor McGregor, finding a way yet again, seemingly with the odds stacked against him, to get his hand raised. He has had doubters every step of the way, and he has muted nearly all of them at this point in time. Big stage, bright lights, and yet again, the brightest star, the notorious Conor McGregor. Congratulations on a big win here tonight.